peace love and light family i hope the sun is shining wherever you are i hope that you're living in your greatest purpose let's get into your messages at this time this message is for cancer again i mentioned that i was going to assure that i do more messages this is going to we're, we're just we're gonna try it out guys and see you know if um if it works out to see if we can do all the water signs so this is for cancer okay this is uh this message that's coming to us for cancer um cancer if you are watching this if your sign is cancer um please assure that you leave a comment um and let me know if you're interested in having these messages um uploaded often because i would gladly put them up and um you know a lot of it depends on the interests you know to make sure that if, you know, that i have some cancer and pisces interested in the messages so um if you are new to the channel cancer welcome welcome we just began doing messages for cancer and pisces it was originally um it was originally just scorpio and i feel like i was led really to include other water signs so let's see how this works out so cancer um if you are watching this for the first time please make sure you subscribe and you leave a comment and let me know if you're interested in seeing these messages okay all right cancer let's see what spirit has for you today Ooh, cancer <laughs> ten of cups right away hmm you know what cancer i've been getting a lot of messages regarding some love coming your way yesterday i received a message from spirit regarding someone wanting to tell you something and perhaps this person wanting to tell you something has to do with a possible ten of cups there's a lot of love in the air for you cancer um this is for my cancer mice cancer signs and i also see a lot of spiritual elevation in your energy okay um and nine of pentacles is having to do with some wish fulfillment there's also some energy regarding your soul tribe coming together with you too so something about the hermit perhaps the person that you're involved with is in this energy i'm not getting that it's you that's in this energy perhaps you were in that energy and you're starting to come out more starting to engage in social events okay so these are the four cards that are in your energy cancer uh we have the ten of cups the hierophant the nine of pentacles and the four of wands so right away i'm really getting this energy of different energies that are in your reading okay you have different energies in your reading uh, meaning different elements fire water earth <laughs> they're all coming out in your energy so i uh, again this energy of being balanced so perhaps the universe is finding a way to balance you i see the judgment card here coming out so something may be coming out working in your favor um hmm. i'm hearing that with this nine of pentacles there may be something regarding some some justice regarding your finances that you're looking to have and i'm hearing that this owl is representative of your spirit guides assuring that you get uh what is owed to you what is coming uh in your path perhaps there's judgment that you're looking to have also in some other area of your life um maybe some betrayal some miscommunication type stuff um okay so all of this is already coming up in your energy uh cancers let's see if we can get some more clarity regarding the uh, ten of cups ten of cups Ooh, this is something that's unexpected that's coming toward you this tower moment here uh this has to do with an unexpected relationship and i think this also came out in your energy yesterday mm, strength card perhaps this is with a fire sign hmm, cancer okay um i'm hearing that there's something unexpected coming your way in regards to your love relationship here and some of you are also ending previous relationships you know some of you may be going through 
you may be ending a previous relationship and it may also have to do with a fire sign uh, possible divorce there may be some you know financial situation involved in this situation in any case I'm hearing that there's something that's ending to make way for the new beginning that you have coming for you here the strength card is also you overcoming something um, you've had to overcome some things cancer yeah you've had to overcome some things and and overcoming this has made you a leader this has put you in an energy where you are more confident in yourself you're seated in this very you know confident energy i'm also hearing cancer that you're someone that others can depend on um you are someone that others can depend on when they're needed and part of it has to do with your third eye you're someone who's able to see things you know beyond surface okay and perhaps this is something that's going to also allow you to manifest this um relationship this ten of cups that's in your energy yeah that you have some manifesting coming cancer yeah yeah i'm hearing man master manifester and look at you the justice card we just said something about justice justice and love Ooh, justice and love this ten of cups perhaps may be your justice in love justice in a relationship situation that you may have previously been in and look what's coming up right side up the lovers yeah there's some love is in the air for you cancer love is in the air for you and this relationship may be bringing a level of closeness perhaps bringing your families together look at you high priestess this is your third eye high fent being clarified with the high priestess this is you being in tune with your intuition okay spirit is saying be careful about making hasty decisions that will restrict you um from you know being free to make other decisions and you as a higher friend here okay this is a commitment many of you i'm really getting this sense that you're getting into a very long-term commitment a connection that's very fulfilling it's fulfilling to your your third eye it's fulfilling to your inner knowing i'm hearing that this connection may actually be helping you mm, look at this it may be helping you um to increase your third eye okay so whatever it is that's that's partnering up with you that this partnering up this this partnering up is going to bring a um, heightened sense of intuition this person is going to help you connect on a soul level hmm, do we dare ask who this person is we know that this is someone that's resilient and look at this this is also a fire sign coming out again i don't know about you and those fire signs scorpios look at you okay fire sign so it may be a fire sign that many of you are connecting with um you know leave a comment down below if there's some connections with the fire sign that's you know you know confirming this let's see about the nine of pentacles i'm getting um, this energy of justice in some financial area regarding this okay this hmm, yeah finances finances this justice is going to come by way of you continuing to work on your craft you're reaching for this abundance you're reaching for this new start um it's coming to you this is your abundance coming to you, your wish fulfillment coming to you. And Spirit is letting you know that you are going to be in this mm, King of Pentacles energy. Mm -hmm. You're going to be in this King of Pentacles energy. And Spirit is alerting you to be cautious uh, because it's easy to get focused and stay focused on material wealth. Um so this king of pentacles comes with a caution okay so this abundance i'm hearing straight away that it comes with a caution this wish fulfillment you have someone something that's coming to you 
okay especially this abundance perhaps you've been energetically hoping to get this it's coming to you and it's coming with a word of caution for you to keep your energy high in order for you to keep this abundance because it's easy for you to you know buy into these illusions and fall back into a state of financial lack okay so this abundance comes with i'm hearing this abundance comes with a warning and it comes with a word of caution for you to continue to spiritually elevate um you may go backwards look at this you know nine of swords this is you in your state of worry and as long as you maintain you know a sense of spiritual balance um you know you will be this empress that's continually manifesting this continually you know in a state of balance and look at this all these heart chakra energy so keep your light keep your heart light because this this is some of the consequences of not doing that okay when you're too hasty when you're you know so pressed to get something and to stay in this energy of um you know material wealth you can you can easily constrict yourself and restrict yourself in many ways and so this is kind of a, a forewarning if you will you know to avoid this state of anxiety and continue to be in the empress energy and justice energy and manifest is you get to keep your heart light okay keep your heart light and i'm also getting this energy of you know remembering your community okay remembering where you come from in order for you to maintain this state of success and victory again this is the heart chakra coming out again this is you keeping your heart light keeping this energy you know don't fall into the traps i'm hearing you know stay away from this energy of keeping up with the joneses because this is where it's going to get you this is where it's going to get you okay um be cautious remember where you come from remember your remember your humble beginnings because you're about to walk into a period of abundance that's what i'm hearing mm -hmm. ah see look at this remember your humble beginnings don't overindulge because you're about to walk into your period of abundance confirmation i couldn't have said it better myself this is spirit confirming what was said okay uh remember where you come from because you're about to you have about to walk into some financial abundance and keep your heart light you know be always connected to spirit connected to you know your innermost self and this is this three of cups is you cancer this is you coming out in your energy and this is an indication to also be cautious of false friends friends who are posing as enemies as you come into this um energy of abundance so there's a lot of warnings for you cancer um you're going to walk into a lot of beautiful energies and you just get to be very um cautious with who you give your energy to and and how you give your energy to maintain this energy of abundance that's coming towards you because it as easily as it comes it can be easily lost that's what i'm hearing you're reaching for the stars in so many different ways you're wanting to have these divine connections and they're coming and you just get to listen to your intuition when they come oh look at that number 21 hearing the truth this is the deary oh let's see what the deary has to say very curious at what the deary has to say number 21 this is three this is today's energy this is leg by energy ways opening for you doors opening for you so spirit is letting you know doors to abundance are being opened to you okay um and this is saying focus on what you know to be true by tuning into what you feel and not focusing on appearances or the opinions of others the voice of spirit is deep within you anytime you want or need guidance you have the ability to tune into that inner voice for peace comfort and clarity it takes courage to turn within rather than put your faith in the people and things of this world but you have enough inner strength and wisdom to do this the truth within has been spoken trust that you can hear it okay 
in the Ngangi Kurungur uh, and Gangi Wu Miri languages of the First Peoples of Australia, Didiri is a spiritual practice of reflective and respectful listening. This, ling this listening goes beyond spoken words. It's perhaps the, perhaps the way the shaman hears it with the soul and perhaps this hermit is referring to, referring to your um your shamanic ability some of you may be shaman okay um reflective and respective listening is he a healing method in modern psychotherapy too deep listening opens us up to the truth without words and their logical meaning it's the way the soul hears and in, in a deeper way beyond words the heart is capable of recognizing what is needed and realizing healing outcomes through care and presence. When you listen with your heart, you have an intuitive ability to recognize truths of the spirit. And this is what spirit is letting you know. You're coming into a lot of abundance. There's going to be some fake ones. There's going to be some real ones. And you get to listen to your most intuitive self in order for you to find the truth for yourself. And this is the message that spirit has for you, Cancer. If this message resonates, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time.